Okay folks, uh, Spoon Guy here. Just wanted to talk to you a little bit about uh, how I've made this. Little olive scoop. Well, it's not out of olive. It's out of a piece of avocado. I'll just uh, have a quick run through how I made it. What I've done is I've got a piece of avocado branch here. As you can see, I've cut a bit off. And then I've split it down the middle. Then, in this case, rather than making a spoon, it comes down this shape, which could have been one way of doing it and quite successful. What I've done is I've come back this way. As you can see there, get that in camera. That's how that's done. So that sits in there. So that's given me that shape of that scoop. So what have I used to do this? I've used a pruning saw, my trusty tomahawk, which has got a little bit of a chunk out of it, my mora sloyd. and a 25mm hook knife. Get out of there. So after cutting that, axe down, got rid of the majority of that, avocado has a large pith so you can see here that the end of the uh, spoon is in fact just one half of that branch cleaned off cut across here with a saw cut across here with a saw so those parts are gone cleaned off with a sloid out of here and then started to hollow that out And after a fair bit of work, 25 is not a bad size, so here we are with it 90% finished. All that remains now is to let it dry. Now if you look carefully, you might see that just on the very end here is the pith. The pith of this branch that has run through, remembering that we've already gotten rid of the pith down the middle when we split this in half and on the inside of the bowl just in the bottom here you can just see perhaps bring this up close you can see the pith in the middle and the pith here so when this is dried a bit more I'll be drying a bit carefully so it doesn't split I'll be able to take that pith out and what that'll be good for is to be able to get into a jar, hoist out an olive, and the juice can drain out. So, using avocado, that is a quite a nice little ladley get the olive out of the jar scoop made by taking a rather obtuse angle on a piece of wood. Again, I could have made a spoon. Just coming here with a bowl there, but in this case I've decided to go this way and I may do the same with this half as well, but we'll wait and see. Thanks for watching and we'll uh, do a few more videos in future.